I liked using the idea of cards and they came about um, in about the 15th century in Italy and they came out of the courts. There's different political characters, kings, queens and jacks. Each of them have different amounts of power. Also, there's different suits, so it's like each character is trying to get certain people on their side. So you've got a very one-dimensional archetype, whereas people are multi-dimensional and, and each model brings something to their character. Also, they correspond with different elements. So the spades are to do with air and thinking, the hearts are to do with love and sacrifice, diamonds are to do with spiritual wealth, and it's kind of like about sowing seeds and you, you reap what you sow. And then the clubs are to do with, uh, they're very primal and base, and it's about reacting. I've used shoes as a way to enter into the whole set of suits. Before each character, I actually worked out what the shoes were like, and then I said, okay, if these shoes are soft and feminine, then the painting of the Queen of Hearts has to be soft and feminine as well. And if you look at somebody like Jack Derrida, he says that the way somebody paints a pair of shoes is crucial to working out the way that person's going to be. The shoes for each of these characters portray an element of that character. So these shoes are soft and they're extravagant and silly, and love is a little bit like that. People will throw everything away for love. These shoes aren't so self-protecting, and I find it really hard to paint them. And I paint them loads and loads of times and they wouldn't work. And when I finally managed to struggle through all that and produce the final painting of the shoes, I realised that it was about fear, and I hadn't realised that when I started painting them. And I realised the key to this kind of character was that it's about courage and adversity or finding yourself in a, a fearful situation and you have to keep a steady head and you have to be able to react and you have to be almost perform and be stronger than you are to kind of keep all the walls at the door. My painting style has changed a lot in the last couple of years. Initially, I, I've got a tendency to work in impasto, which is working with very thick layers of paint. And I decided to go back to drawing and using that as a foundation for the paintings. I worked up in glazes, translucent glazes, but I felt the paintings were still a little bit too flat. Without thinking about it, I seemed to start working up in thicker layers again. But this time, the paint was getting more modelled rather than being in thick layers applied all in one go. And I like leaving some areas kind of rough and even drawn. And you can see on the paintings, there's areas where there's just charcoal on bare canvas, where other areas are modelled. And for me, it gives it a kind of fluidness in the paintings and it gives you breathing space. 